Hello everyone. It oh hello everyone. <laughs> it is Miss Myers, the music teacher from SAC Prep. Had to wait till the video started there. Um, I'm gonna go over the worksheets um, from uh, for this week um, for April fourth through six. Uh, sorry, April sixth through tenth. Um, again, I don't know what day it is either. Uh, so this is for third and fourth grade. So remember that I had given you one really long packet last week. Keep working on that packet. I'm going to put um, I'm going to put a resource on my website where you can get some help with that. So um, I believe it's sfskids.org, and that's basically the San Francisco Symphony Orchestra has this whole great um, resource for um, instruments of the orchestra and how they work and so I think that would be really helpful to help complete that packet so you can use that. I'm going to put that on my website today but let's go over what I want you guys to do this week. There's not much okay because I gave you such a big one last week. So first thing you're going to do I want you to read these pages or have someone read them to you okay just read the two pages. Um, you can take notes if you want to, try to underline key words or key ideas, main ideas, you know, anything you might do in ELA, I want you to kind of do that. Or if you don't want to read the whole thing, you can just read to sum it up, okay? You can just read this part if you don't want to read the whole thing. But if you got nothing else to do, and I know you don't, read the whole thing. Um, the worksheet. I'm not making you fill this out. I just want... To let you know that now. So if you have questions about it and you're like, oh, I can't fill it out, this is really hard, don't worry about it, okay? You don't have to because that's kind of not the idea with this. The idea is just give you some history about it because we're going to start talking about the blues um, again um, in uh, when we when we get to our distant learning. We're going to start doing that, okay? If you want to fill this out, if you read it and you took notes and you underlined main ideas and, and key ideas and things like that, maybe you cubed through the reading, um, you circle, underline, boxed, all that stuff. If you want to fill this out, great. But if you don't, I am not going to take points off if you didn't, okay? That's not really the idea with this packet. The idea with this packet is, and I know that if you're in fourth grade, you've already done this. Um, this is what we were working on before we uh, left school. So, but we're going to continue this because we never quite finished it. So I'm hoping when we get to the distant learning, I'm going to start including third grade in this too. Um, so this is a set of um, your AA blues line. Now remember, your blues form is AABA1. Okay, I'm going to write that down so you can see it. A A B A 1. And remember, A and A are the same line and the same melody. Same line, same melody. Okay, we went over that. These are the same eight lines that I assigned you in your groups, but until we zoom and we do um, maybe some group zoom rooms, which I think we'll have the ability to do that. Um, I'm going to have all of you work on these by yourself. So this is what you're going to do on this worksheet. You are going to pick one of these, one of these. Okay. Underline it. I want you to underline it. Okay. So I'm going to pick, uh, I'm going to pick number two. Okay. I underlined it. I went up to order, but they were out of fries. So here's what I'm going to do right now. I'm going to do this on the bottom of this page. I'm going to write A and then I'm just going to write neatly. Okay, always write neatly. I went up to order, but they were out of fries. Okay, and then I'm going to write A again. Okay, so this is what I did. See, it's pretty neat. Not the best, but pretty neat. Okay, I just re I just copied the line. This is just handwriting practice right now for you guys. Okay, I just copied the line. And then guess what I'm going to do? Because in the blues, the first two lines repeat. They're the same melody and the same line. Guess what? I'm going to write it again. This is my second A. I went up to order, but they were out of frets. Okay, just like this. 
Now, if you don't want to use the rest of this page, write it on a different page. I'm fine with that, okay? I'm perfectly fine with that. So this particular packet, I'm actually, um, don't hand in right now because we are going to do the B section. That's coming in next week's packet. Um, this packet will be available for pickup uh, tomorrow, Wednesday, April 8th, from 8.30 to 12.30. And then again, from 3.30 to 5.30 in the SAC Prep Cafeteria. If you have any questions about it, please email me at jmyers at sacprep.org. J-M-E-Y-E-R-S at sacprep.org. Um, yes, you can probably figure out that the B line is coming next week. So, And then I think um, even... I'll have you do the A1 line as well next week. And so that's going to be your assignment. So if you've already, if you're in fourth grade and you already wrote your B line with your group and you remember it, then go ahead and write it down. If you don't remember it um, or you didn't get a chance to do it, then don't worry about it because that's going to be your assignment for next week. But again, the only assignment you have is to pick one of these lines, underline it, write it twice on the bottom. Okay, pick one, underline it, Write it twice on the bottom or on another piece of paper. It's up to you. Okay, write it neatly because you're going to need it. And then that's it. That's all. So, And then again, I'm going to put up that resource um, for San Francisco uh, Symphony Orchestra so you guys can use that to kind of help you finish last week's packet if you're having problems. All right? Stay safe, and hopefully I'll see you soon.